What's up everyone, Base Senpai here, here today to give you an updated manga collection for the year of 2017. It's been about 13 months and I, since I've done one of these videos. Uh, I haven't gotten too much stuff, but uh, I definitely have gotten enough to warrant another collection video. Uh, recently redid my room, new paint, new carpet, and I decided to tidy up the bookcase. I have gotten rid of all the stuff on the top seeing that it just it makes the bookcase a lot cleaner uh and it's not so cluttered i do have a few series uh remaining that are kind of out because i got them recently and they're just out um but yeah let's i'm gonna kind of go through the first shelf pretty quickly because it's mainly just light novels um but yeah let's get started uh certain magical index one and two black bullet uh, is it wrong to try to pick up girls in a dungeon? One to three. Um, Kizu Monogatari and then Baka Monogatari one and two. Uh, anime is like one of my favorite animes of all time. Uh, too bad Aniplex owns the right and I'm not paying like 180 bucks for, um, the disc format. Like I wouldn't mind paying like a hundred bucks for Monogatari, but, uh, I, the fact that it like, 12 episodes comes on like six discs. I'm not really a fan, uh, and therefore I will not be buying it. Um, Konosuba, I love the anime. Anime is probably the funniest anime I've seen in recent uh, memory. Uh, definitely check out the light novel. Uh, Log Horizon 1, No Game, No Life 1 and 2. Overlord, Strike the Blood 1, Sword Art Online 1 to 5. The Devil is a Part-Timer 1, The Isolator and that pretty much sums up the rest of the light novels that I have. Um, on to manga. We have 20th Century Boys 1 and 2. Still here. Still haven't read. It's uh, quite remarkable that this series has been on my shelf for almost 3 years. And it hasn't been read. And I haven't gotten any more volumes. It is on my forever to-do list. But I'll get to it eventually. Alice in Murderland 1 and 2. The artwork was really cool on the first volume. Uh, but that's about it. I haven't read it. And I have no interest in reading it. So, uh, Black Lagoon 1 to 10. Awesome Seinen series. Definitely check it out uh, if you haven't read it. Mm, Blade of the Immortal 1 to 31. Uh, Dark Horse has just started releasing the 1 and 2 Onibus forms. I highly recommend you guys get those instead of trying to find the... I guess single volumes. Single volumes are either out of print or they're standard Dark Horse prices, which are like $13.99, $14.99 US prices. So um, definitely check it out. It's I don't know how many volumes are out, but definitely check it out. It's one of the better uh, samurai swordsman uh, manga out. Citrus, one to four. Uh, Yuri is... Uh, I don't... You know what? I This is one of the Yuri series I like. I don't like all Yuri because of the artwork. Uh, but I really like the artwork in Citrus, so I definitely recommend it. Uh, I'm going to butcher this. Die Welder Gelder. Die Were Gelder. It's by the same manga who did uh, Blade of the Immortal. Never read it. Uh, that's going to be a ongoing theme of my collection is never read it. So uh, Next we have Dora Hidoro, 1 to 5. Uh, I really like this series, uh, but 6 was out of print for a while and then it finally came in print and was about to order it but then seven went out of print and then I was kind of in this vicious cycle of the next volumes were out of print so I just never never got around to it. Gangsta won the six. I'm missing seven. The manga just came off I hate us. Hopefully we get more gangsta. I really enjoy the series. The anime was lackluster um, but overall I really love the, the manga. Good night pun pun. Haven't read it. I don't even think I have any interest in reading it. I know it's critically acclaimed as one of the better, one of the best manga. Personally, uh, Inio Asano is. I flip through some of her other works, and I'm just, I it's not for me. Uh, it's just not for me. Uh, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Part One, one the three, and then JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Part Two, one the four. I'm gonna wait till I finish Stardust Crusaders. Uh, and then I'm going to go binge read all of it and then wait for the four to come out. Message the Adolf, one and two, my only Osama Tessica work. I'm trying to get Buddha, but um, I don't know. I'm trying to find the right one. Uh, I had to get these before they went out of print and they went out of print. Luckily, I have them for my collection. I don't know if I'm... I'll read it 
I don't, I don't even know. I, I just kind of own it just to own it. I don't, I, I, I don't know if I have any interest in reading it. Uh, Mobile Suit Gundam, The Origin, 1 to 12. Uh, beautiful, beautiful hardcovers. Um, knowing uh, Vertical's history with hardcovers, I decided to grab them just in case they ever went out of print. I'm, I, they're pretty much in print still, but I'm glad I have all of them. I still only read like one of them, though. Monster, 1 to 9. Uh, perfect Edition Complete. Uh, I actually just recently finished this about a couple months ago. Um, overall, really good series. Naoki Urasawa is a fantastic uh, storyteller. Um, the ending is a little bit lackluster, but uh, overall the series as a whole, is it's awesome. Uh, Planets, haven't read it. I should because it's by the mangaka who did uh, Vinland Saga, and I absolutely love Vinland Saga. Uh, please tell me, Galko chan this is like a girly toilet humor of one pay like four kona it's like uh it's really weird honestly it's like um it's like girly questions that shouldn't be answered in in public they're like private girl questions i don't know it's really weird but uh it's pretty funny i had a couple chuckles reading it so uh if if you're looking for something a little bit funny lighthearted, i check it out prison school won the four uh, it's honestly my favorite ecchi manga. I mainly, I don't even read it for uh, the plot and the fan service. I mainly just read it because of the humor. Uh, it's absolutely hilarious. And I think if you haven't, if you're on the fence about it just because of the fan service, I think you should uh, read it just because I think it's absolutely phenomenal. Terraformers, one to five. And then we have um, six to 11. I feel bad. I haven't uh, been keeping up to this on this series. It's... Um, Honestly, one of the f series that I really, really enjoyed. The character art is awesome. The just the artwork in in general is fantastic. So uh, I feel bad not keeping up to date on it. I honestly haven't been keeping up to date on a lot of series, uh, but I'm gonna try to do a little better. Tokyo Ghoul won the twelve. Uh, twelve's right here. Um, I honestly only read like up to volume six, and I'm just gonna wait. Uh, and reread the whole thing once 14 comes out. Uh, but other than that, I'm really excited. I'm not really into the anime, even though I own season one. But uh, hopefully, I, I, I'm just really excited to finally finish it. Ubel Blot won the 0-4. to four. This is technically the first 10 volumes. Uh, I checked it out after one of my friends recommended it to me after saying it was sort of like uh, Berserk. It, I could see the resemblance. It's not as good as Berserk, but it's definitely worth a check out if you're absolutely uh, in love with Berserk. Vagabond, 1 to 7. Still don't, still haven't finished this series. It's uh, it's like my second favorite uh, manga of all time. Hopefully we get like a really crazy anime adaptation one day. It's highly unlikely just because the artwork is so fantastic and I don't know if it would translate well into animation form. Uh, but definitely check it out if you haven't. Vinland Saga won the seven. Another manga that I wish had an anime, but it probably falls in the same lines of Vagabond, where uh, it just probably wouldn't translate well with the artwork, because the artwork in Vinland Saga is fantastic. Yamushi Petal one and two. I'm honestly prefer the anime over the manga. I just picked up the manga because I was um the anime is fantastic. I actually started biking because of the the anime. I went out and got like one of those uh cycling bikes i don't know exactly the street bikes i don't know what they're called uh but i've been biking every day and uh absolutely love it a certain scientific railgun won the 10 i haven't seen this in many people's collections uh i don't know why i think the artwork's pretty good the story's all right um i don't know i, I wish i saw more of it. it it's definitely enjoyable ajin won the six uh i haven't seen the anime but Overall, it started off a little slow. I didn't really like the beginning, but once um, it got a little further, it got really good, and I uh, probably should pick up the rest of it and get caught up to date. A Kamiga Kill, one to six. The anime was really good up to a point, probably about episode 18 or 19, uh, and then it kind of went on its own. But overall, uh, I haven't really read the manga, but I'm pretty sure the manga is just as good. Assassination Classroom won the six. Attack on Titan, no regrets, one and two. It's Levi's backstory, not mandatory. Attack on Titan, one to 20. Um, 
the manga actually said he only wanted to go up to 20 volumes way back probably around like volume seven or eight maybe even six ish before the anime even came out he didn't want it to go very long but attack on titans ending probably soon um so i'm gonna wait till it's done and then uh binge read it bakuman won the 20 haven't read it berserk won the 14 and then 15 and 16 is over here arguably my favorite manga of all time it just it's so emotionally uh meant uh, it just meant a lot to me i've never been seething mad after reading something before um usually you know sometimes in tears but never just angry um but yeah it was really good definitely recommend it uh have have to pick up the rest of it but i'm content with owning 16 volumes black clover won the two i'm actually gonna pick up more of this series i've heard it gets a little better uh so overall i'm gonna i'm gonna keep collecting it. it's on my wish list bleach one to 67 yeah uh overall really good uh it's probably my it's my out of the big three it's my least favorite uh it should have ended at volume 48 uh but after the success like the success of uh the aizen finale i think they he was kind of forced to go on and i think really think he should have ended it um but overall i still haven't even finished reading it online so uh blood lad one two eight um it is actually it's finished believe it or not it's the first manga i ever picked up and uh i'm finally glad to have you know all eight volumes i definitely plan on reading it again uh because i've i've read like volumes one to four like so many times so i gotta reread it again and then uh finish it i guess bloom into you it's just a yuri manga i haven't read it i i kind of like the artwork but after reading a couple chapters of it i and I, I don't know if it's for me blue exorcist one two thirteen uh not really interested in blue exorcist anymore uh batum one to eight uh yeah that's all i'm gonna get a batum nothing much to say about it cage of eden one to 19 i think the last volume comes out uh in june and i can't can't wait for that because it's been a while since i've uh, bought a cage of eden manga so uh if you're interested in lost i definitely give it a recommendation it's a decent story of high schoolers trapped on an island with like dinosaurs and stuff uh give it a read it's pretty good claymore one to 27 still haven't read claymore um I need to read it. I don't know what I'm doing. Dead Man Wonderland 1. And then Dead Man Wonderland 1 to 13. I, st I haven't read it. I don't know. I really... Like, I'm like volume 6 or 7-ish. Maybe 8. And it was so... It was really good. I really enjoyed it. I just... Probably need to go back and just read it again. I, it's depressing, I know. Death Note 1 to 12. Awesome. Love Death Note. I'm probably going to pick up... um. Um, their new series. I don't know what it's called off the top of my head. Um, but Eden won the 14. Still haven't read it. It's actually, I heard really good things about it in the anime manga. Um, put it in his top 20. So if, if, you know, I respect his words. So I went out and bought it and, uh, we'll read it eventually. Uh, hopefully it's good. Uh, fairy tale one, two, 52. I think like 58 is out. Uh, fairy tale is ending really soon. I probably should get caught up to date. It's one. It's actually the first shonen manga that I ever collected, believe it or not. Um, so yeah, I know it's not the best. I know that's a lot of fan service, but overall, I I do like uh, fairy tale. Whether it's just the same, it's the same thing every time. So, uh, Food Wars one to sixteen. I really like what they do. With, uh, did with Food Wars. It was super etchy in the beginning. Uh, and then it kind of simmered down towards the end and it's actually like, it's really good. I, it's in a good place. Uh, definitely recommend it. Um, if you read like the first couple volumes and got turned off by the fan service, forget it because like after a while it just, it's non-existent. Um, I finally did it. I finally got rid of the three in one full metal alchemist volumes, those pieces of trash. Um, and finally got some, uh, single volumes, uh, which is awesome because I love single volumes and those three and ones by um, uh, Viz Media were just terrible. 
Gantz won them 10, and then 17, 18, and 20. Uh, 17 and 18 and 20 are still in the cellophane. Uh, I haven't got... A lot of it's out of print. I think 16 and 19 are notoriously out of print. I think 16 more so than 19. I probably will never get it, uh, but who knows? Um, let's see. All right. Um, Girlfriends 1 and 2, the first Yuri manga I ever purchased. Um, Haiku. Probably said that wrong. Uh, I really love the anime. Uh, anime's fantastic. I haven't picked up any of the manga. I do not know why. Uh, volume 11's coming out in June, so I'm probably going to pick up a lot of it. I'm probably going to do a big pickup uh, spree in a, in a couple days. Hagane won the 10. Uh, it's just one It's one of my favorite animes, so I leave, uh, left it up on the shelves. I like the, the spine art, too. It's bright and yellow. High School of the Dead won the 7. Um... It's nice. It's one of the first etchy mangas I actually have. It's actually, the, I think, the first etchy anime I ever watched. So, I, it, you know, I just left it up there. Um, Higurashi, When They Cry, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2. Uh, it's good. It's, I don't know if it's for me. I don't know. I'll come back to it. Hunter X, I mean, Hiatus X Hiatus, uh, 1 to 5. Um... I watched the anime. I actually binge watched the 2011 anime, and I recommend you do the same. Um, I'll eventually pick this up, but for now, it's not a priority. I am a hero. Uh, good zombie uh, manga. Definitely need to pick up more of it. JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, Stardust Crusaders, one volume. I just, uh, I got it. I was planning on getting them all, but then Viz uh, announced that they were doing the the hardcover so I stopped so glad I didn't get all of it um Knights of Sidonia won the three uh still haven't read it uh Magi one two 22 yeah 22 uh I was really turned off originally by the cover of the first volume uh yeah I was like eh, I don't know that's it maybe not for me but eventually decided to grab it and I'm Super glad I did because this series has some phenomenal artwork. Like, this cover is so badass. So is this one. I mean, most of the covers after a certain while, they just, they're sick. Uh, so definitely recommend Magi. It's a great story. Magical Girl Apocalypse, one to seven. Uh, this is the series I was super on the fence about. Uh, the first volume was like, what the hell is going on? Uh, second volume had some like weird... Uh, weird stuff some very suggestive content i was very close to dropping it but the, at the very end of the third volume there's a plot twist and then the series kind of picked up and it's it's pretty good there's a couple more volumes out and i just haven't uh, picked them up yet monster masume won the eight uh another favorite etchy uh manga this is like one of the remain like i don't have much i kind of took all the etchy manga off my shelf i've left a couple that at least were high quality in my eyes so uh it's one of the remaining few so uh my hero academia won the eight i love this series i think it's great uh hopefully it can fill the you know the big uh void left that naruto and like bleach and all those big series uh you know did but overall it's a great series can't wait for more um my love story one nine yeah one the nine uh this is awesome. I love this. I, I am pretty positive it is a shoujo, but it's more of a... a uh, I, God, my, I'm having a blank right now. Um, shonen. Yeah, there's the word. Uh, it's more told like a shonen series, so I, re I really enjoy it. I've read like four volumes of it. I'm definitely going to finish reading it eventually. My Neighbor Seki won the seven awesome uh, series. It's my most underrated series that I own. Naruto 28 to 72. Yeah, uh, I love Naruto. I think it's, personally, it's my favorite. I don't think it's the best, but overall, it's my favorite. Um, Kaka Naruto Kakashi Story, haven't read it. Nisekoi won the 13. I've dropped this series. It's, it's dragged on long enough, and it ended, and it didn't end the way I wanted it, so I'm salty. 
Uh, no Longer Human 1 and 2. Can't find the third volume, which sucks. Um, let's see. Noragami. 1 to 14. Never been read. I do not know why. Uh, the, I watched the first season of the anime. It was definitely good. Um, I just haven't read it. It's really weird. I haven't read a lot of good series. One Piece, 1 to 30. And then uh, during the move, I... Well, not the move, but when I was redoing my room, I lost the one of the hinges for the shelf. So this whole um, shelf needs... Um, a screws but here's a one piece 31 31 to 60 and then we finish it off with 61 to 79 uh overall the new world has been lackluster i still have to finish the um the del flamingo uh arc so i haven't actually seen luffy go uh, gear four yet so yeah Japanese volumes of One Punch Man 1 and 2, and then 1 to 11 of One Punch Man. Uh, this series is awesome. Uh, yeah, I really like uh, really like One Punch Man. And Parasite 1 to 8. Overall good series. People Chew, it's uh, by Felipe Smith, an American manga who went to Japan to publish his, uh, his manga. Overall, it's pretty good. It's short. I don't recommend buying one to see if you like it. I just recommend you uh, buy all three. Uh, it's kind of dirty, but overall, it's pretty funny. So, Prophecy won the three, and then um, Siren won the 14, and then the last two volumes are down here. Uh, overall, I think Siren is pretty good. It's a little... Um, I think the last volume is a little bit lackluster, but uh, yeah. Sorry, I'm, I'm like literally on the floor. So, uh, Rosario and Vampire... 1 to 10 and then 1 to 14 is complete. It's not like the anime. I think I, I always preach this, but like the anime, the second season of the anime is literally like these three volumes right here. Uh, it's ridiculous. And like the first season is like two volumes. It's actually quite funny how they did that. Um, Sankarea, 1 to 11, uh, zombie, rom com, harem. It's pretty good. It's sure it's it's complete but yeah seraph of the end one two eleven i love seraph of the end this is this series is awesome uh the cover the first cover when i saw it originally i was like eh, i'm not i'm not feeling it but then i saw the second cover and i was like all right all right i'll i can i'll check this out and overall i really enjoy it um so yeah the seven deadly sins one to eighteen whoo I like this series. This series is, is this series is awesome. Uh, I'm like volume on volume like 15. No, no, I don't know where I'm at. Maybe 16. Uh, but yeah, definitely recommend the Seven Deadly Sins. It's awesome. Uh, Soul Eater won the 25. Uh, it's one of my favorite uh, shonen series. I really definitely enjoy it. Um, yeah, definitely check it out. Toriko one to 35. Oh god, this camera angle is bad. Um, yeah, love Toriko. Uh, it's kind of falling off towards the end, uh, but what series honestly continues being good? Uh, that's you know, this long. So overall, it's pretty good. Triage X one to eleven, another etchy series that made the cut. Trinity seven made the cut because it's all the way in the bottom, and I don't really give a crap. And then uh, World Trigger one to nine. Overall, it's all right. It's not the best. Oh, alrighty. Woo. All right, that's done. I'm going to go through a little bit of this. Um, so I decided to kind of put away series that I did not really enjoy. Uh, I mean, I enjoyed Yamada Kun and the Seven Witches, but it wasn't like, is it worth a spot on my bookcase? And no, it's not. Um, this series, Girl on the Shore... This, I don't even know what the hell is going I, I haven't read it. I do not know what's going on, but I flipped through that, and I don't want to know what's actually going on. So, um, so MPD Psycho. Um, this is a pretty good series. Well, I haven't even read it, so I can not even comment. Orange, Dura Ra, Maria and the Virgin Witch, Judge, Doubt, D. Gray Man, uh, Spice and Wolf, uh, and then a lot of etchy series at the bottom, like, uh, like High School DxD and... Oh mama, um, oh mamari hamari and just stuff like that. Overall, um, 
I just don't want it on my shelf anymore. Uh, so yeah. And then finally we'll just go to um, my tiny anime collection. Uh, recently picked up One Punch Man. Um, the Code Geass. This is still in the cellophane. I've never even watched Code Geass, but I uh, started watching it. So it's definitely pretty good. Uh, we have Defrag, Guilty Crown, Psycho Pass, The World God Only Knows. Stein's Gate, Problem Children Coming from Another World, Hagane, Hagane Season 2, Helsing Ultimate, Awesome Series, Guilty Crown, Film of Alchemist Brotherhood, uh, more Defrag, Attack on Titan, Cowboy Bebop, Devil is a Part-Timer, Angel Beats, Tokyo Ghoul, uh, more The World God Only Knows, Future Diary, and then some Yu Yu Hakusho at the bottom. Uh, alrighty. My goal was to make this video short and 25, a little under 26 minutes. I say that's a good job. Um, yeah, I've been, I've honestly, I know it's going to sound cliche, but I've really been sick for the past like year, like year. I, I've, it's been really bad. Um, and talking for this long and this fast, I've been trying to, uh, uh, I don't know. It's, it's definitely tough. It's definitely haven't been doing this in a while. Uh, but yeah, I definitely have a lot to you know, catch up on. I've been mainly just video, playing video games and stuff. I, I was doing World of Warcraft for a while. Uh, I kind of got burned out of that because I was, you know, raiding, you know, like mythics and stuff. And I just, it's, t it's too much for me. So, um, just playing other games, Fire Emblem, uh, Pokemon, stuff like that. Uh, other than that, um, thank you for sticking around. If you've made it to the end of this video, um, no guarantees on the next video. I just, everyone li likes these uh, manga collection videos. So I wanted to put one out at least once a year. I can do that at least. Um, unless like if I don't get any manga uh, for the next year, which is highly doubtful. Uh, but yeah, um, I think my collections, uh, the last video was like 1191. So, and I've definitely got nine volumes in the past year. So it's definitely over 1200. Uh, it's just not 1200 on the shelf. I think it's, I don't know how much manga is in this book in, in this box uh but yeah all right thank you so much for uh sticking around this is base senpai and i appreciate you watching my video have a good one